Good day everyone, especially to Mr. Rusty Cotolibas, our Spec 104 instructor. Good day, sir. I'm Mark Lian Lovido Labisic, a first-year Bachelor of Physical Education student at the Cerizal Memorial State University, Dipolog Campus. And for today's video, I'll be presenting a narrative video about the skeletal system. Let's get started. This is a model of a human bone, not the real human skeleton. Let's take a look at the human skeleton. Every human has a skeleton made up of a large number of bones. A single adult human body has 206 bones, but a newborn has 300 bones because babies have smaller bones which combine to make larger bones. Look at this closely. This is our skull. It supports our face as well as carrying our brain. It shields the brain from bumps and bruises. The stirrup, the smallest bone in our body, is located in our ears and measures about 2.5 to 3.3 millimeters in length. The clavicles are the shoulder or collar bones. It's the body's only horizontally oriented long bone. Now, consider this, a sternum is a long flat bone in the chest. Have you noticed how it looks like a necktie? It can be found in the middle of your chest. Our rib cage is this cage-like structure. The rib cage is the curved wall of ribs that covers and protect our hearts and lungs and other vital organs. Examine the hand's bones now. The humerus is the long bone of the upper arms that extends from shoulder to elbow and is located in the hand. The radius and ulna are two other lengthy bones in our hands. The carpal, metacarpal, and phalanges are the bones in the palm that make up the lower arm. Let's take a look at the back side of this ensemble. The spine is made up of 33 little bones called vertebrates and the entire structure is called spine. The spine aids in twisting and bending as well as holding your body upright. Now, consider this. This is a girdle for the pelvis. It safeguards the uterus and bladder. The femur is the longest and strongest bone in our body. And the tarsals, metatarsals, and phalanges are the bones in the lower leg. Fibula and tibia. Collagen makes up the majority of human bone. It's a flexible protein that's woven into a framework. It also has calcium carbonate, phosphate, and minerals that provide the frame strength and heart. Collagen and calcium work together to give the bone its flexibility and strength. You're an expert on the skeletal system. Our bone requires special attention. We should exercise, run, dance, and participate in outdoor activities. That's all for today's video. See you on my next video.